Ready? It's messages for Ryan Reynolds and Rob Macklin. One, you should be here right now with your squad. Two, your team about to go down in North Carolina. Let's go! Again, you got to be careful. There's a shot and there's a goal. Nice spin move here by Lloyd. Lloyd! Another shot and another goal. Well, there's Trundle with the left and Trundle with his second goal. Here's a turnover. Jarvis, there it is. Game over. So embarrassing to brag before the game saying, oh, you're going down and then lose 12 and 0. To then say, and I quote, we're super proud. What's the worst that could happen? We lose 16 and 0. And that's the problem. They need to stop categorizing female sports as sports and just label it as comedy. And they will have a lot more people watching. And then they could get more money. Until then, <laughs> it's just it's just garbage. A guy can't disappoint you. You know, he, he he's a good, good father. He is, you know, and, and he, he has the best intentions for you. His yeah. plans are to prosper you. Yeah. Bring you to an expected end. But your life does not. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> she was alive. God doesn't disappoint. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. Since you guys are besties, have you ever thought about each other in like a romantic way? No. Stop the cap. Never? Never. <laughs> <laughs> what we had before. Have you guys ever kissed before? Of course. Yes, I did. Why do you have him in the friend zone? Because I'm a friend. I have a boyfriend. Oh, you have a boyfriend? Yes, I do. And your boyfriend knows you guys are best friends? Yes. Do you guys get along? Mm -mm. No. Why? Why? I don't know. Tell? It's very, very strong, uh, hard relationships, let's say. He seems like a good guy. I think he kind of likes you. Yeah, he's a good guy, but he's my best friend. It's an evil world we live in, but hey, I'm going to keep living. It's amazing how Juan Meow has finessed these two clowns. One, she knows that her best friend wants to smash and be more than just friends. And two, her boyfriend is stupid enough to allow the friend to be around his girl, knowing that he wants to smash and be with his girl. The meow is strong for real, bruv. Gentlemen, if you're only getting one hole, you're settling. You deserve all three. And don't let anyone tell you any different. How old are you? 53. At your age, have you found that dating has become easier or harder for you? Absolutely harder. Why is that? Less pool. Men seem to want just one thing. I thought I would outgrow that with men, but um, no, they do not. They still just want sex. Even in their 50s? Yes. 50-year-old men. Are they going for women in their age category or younger women? They want women in their category, but they pretty much go for the younger woman. Did you hear what this old dry powder kitty lady said? Old men want older women, but they younger. How is it they grow old and not grow out of their delusions? Hmm. It's all right. <laughs> it's okay. It's I didn't mind it at all. It's, it's quite fine. <laughs> if you made this far into the video, go ahead and hit that like and the subscribe button for your boy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sexually, I can probably have whatever the fucking guy I want to. A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit? You know one thing that drives me absolutely crazy is when I'm having a conversation with somebody and I'm like, hey, let's go do these things on these dates. And I say, cool, sounds good. Let me have a conversation with my fiance and I'll keep you posted. And immediately they're like, you have to ask him for permission. Does he own you? First of all, let's not be childish. Second of all, when you are in a relationship, the decisions you make affect your partner. It's called consideration, respect, and maturity. So low-key in the back of my head, I am thinking, oh my gosh, this is why you're single. Misery loves company. Women can't stand to see other women happy. They always wanted to be down just like them. Just imagine, just think about it. We live in a time where if a woman shows her mad respect, it's looked down upon. Do you trust your man around other women? Yes. Yeah. Do you trust other women around your man? 
No. If women don't even trust other women, why would they expect a man to trust women? That's a good point. <laughs> you are not Told the father. you. What? Told you, bro. Are you serious? Told you. Can I really rock? On stream, but the way this conversates, he could just hold up. We could just Conversate talk is not a word, for no dumb way. long about random just and he it. cool as Conversate's not a word? No, it's not a real word. People just be saying that shit. You're either having a conversation or you're conversing, but you don't conversate. Okay, look, is conversate a correct grammar? Click on that. Is it correct? It might be a word, but is it correct grammar? Okay, well, I got proven, proven wrong twice. You keep talking, man. And you shut the f up. Huh? And can you believe that they have men who have arguments with women? Oh, let me tell you all a story real quick. Listen to this. When I was younger, about 18 years old, I forgot my phone at home when I went to work. When I got home, <laughs> I had 23 missed calls from my mom. I went to my mom and asked her, what was the emergency? What was the problem? She said, what am I talking about? I said, well, I have 23 missed calls from you. So what is it that you needed? She said, oh, no, you forgot your phone home. So I was giving you a call to let you know that you forgot it home. And that is the day I knew I would never have an argument with a woman. Guys, you have to stop. Mm. I'm usually on your side, but on this one, I need to let you know you are creating mm. monsters. You are so thirsty that you are validating fours and fives, making them believe that they're fucking ten. Then you want to cry mm. about, oh, women are delusional. You, you're the one doing that. I mean, I'm not saying they're not delusional on their own, but you are contributing though. You are putting women on a pedestal and then you want to complain, well, women want six feet, six figures, six packs, six, six, six. Yes, your fault. And you guys are doing all of that, why? Because you're thirsty for a pussy. Yes. How about you become thirsty for real qualities, like real values, like integrity, good human qualities, you know, like the basic stuff that a bunch of bitches don't have. How about you start by doing that? That would be a start. I like your grab from the back. I've have never, you ever had it? Oh, never what? Had You've never been like hitting it from the back and then like she like reached back and grabbed your and then grabbed your balls. It's amazing. It's an amazing feeling. I ain't never had that ever happen to me. I'm trying to get see what that be like right there. Look, be that, 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 that. Hey, what's up? Nothing. I have some that I need for us to try later, okay? Yeah, I have to go and, um, I have to go and prepare some things. So I'll end the video right there. My name is AJ, and they call me the God. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like and the subscribe button for more of this non sugar coating content. Until next time. Same. Let's go. 90. I found you right in the sea floor. I have to see you could be.